Well, Jeffy's bedtime. Sounds... interesting enough. But how will it be? Let's find out. The video begins with Jeffy playing with this curious George in a box, and I love how Mario and Rosalina are just sitting there while he plays, like they both know what's going to happen. George pops out of the box, and Jeffy screams, scaring Mario and Rosalina. Jeffy begins winding up the box again, and Mario tells Jeffy to stop. Jeffy does it again anyways, and Mario tells Jeffy to stop again. And Jeffy does what he does best, ignores Mario. And you can just see it in Jeffy's expression, he, he just knows what he's doing. And that combined with just the scenario already brings the episode to a good start. Mario tells Jeffy there's a monkey in the box, and Jeffy is... surprised by this, and he gets scared again. Mario finally takes the toy away, and Mario tells Jeffy it's time for him to go to bed. Rosalina goes and helps Jeffy put on his pajamas, and after that, Jeffy said someone pooped his pants. Uh, okay. Jeffy explains this in just a bit too much detail for my taste. I mean, I probably won't dock the video for this, but, I mean, really, Logan? Mario says that Jeffy needs to go to sleep, and that Mario and Rosalina are going to go have adult time. Jeffy says he has to get one more in. Uh, Jeffy, what's that supposed to mean? Well, whatever. Mario and Rosalina leave, and Mario asks Rosalina what she wants to do, and she suggests a movie. And then suddenly we see Jeffy screaming at his curious George in a box. Mario asks Jeffy why he isn't in bed, and Jeffy says it's too dark in his room. So Mario and Rosalina have to go put a nightlight in his room. However, this apparently isn't enough, so they keep adding lights. Eventually, Jeffy is satisfied, and Mario and Rosalina go back to what they were doing. Rosalina says that they could do whatever Mario wants. Yeah, uh, Jeffy appears again. Okay, if it wasn't confirmed before, it's confirmed now. How does Jeffy get into the room without them hearing him? He can teleport, confirmed. I mean, whatever. Jeffy says that he didn't get a bedtime story, and Mario says to Rosalina that Jeffy may not be satisfied with just one story. However, Rosalina is much more optimistic, so they get Jeffy green eggs and ham. This was a bad choice because Jeffy decides that he wants green eggs and ham too. Mario tries to tell Jeffy it doesn't exist because it's a book, but Jeffy isn't buying it, and Rosalina says that they should just go make it for him. Mario tells Jeffy to read the book, and they leave to make the green eggs and ham by actually painting the eggs and ham green. Aren't certain paints toxic though? And I don't think that's a non-toxic paint they're using. So, whatever, I guess Jeffy's gonna die. Mario and Rosalina come back with green eggs and ham, and Jeffy goes on a rant about how Sam I Am is a liar in the book. And I just find this scene absolutely hilarious. Jeffy then says that because Sam I Am is a liar, he doesn't want the green eggs and ham. Mario tells Jeffy he has everything he wants, what with the book and the light, and asks if Jeffy will leave him alone. Jeffy says yes, and you all know where this is going. Despite that, it's actually kind of funny. Mario and Rosalina decide to continue adult time, but before they can do, or whatever they decide to do, Jeffy comes back again. And I just love Mario's reaction to this. Mario tells Jeffy to stop bothering him, and Jeffy says there is a monster under his bed, and that the monster is going to poop in his pajamas. What? Mario is doing everything he can to get Jeffy to go to bed, and so Mario checks to see if there is a monster under Jeffy's bed. Although, frankly, I was kind of expecting for there to be either be a monster or a Five Nights at Freddy's character or something under the bed. But hey, I mean, glad you proved me wrong, Logan. Jeffy says the monster only appears when they aren't around, so Mario puts up a monster destroyer. Actually, it's just a baby monitor. Jeffy is satisfied, and when Mario and Rosalina go back into the living room, they see Jeffy smacking his diaper. Mario and Rosalina are about to start, but Jeffy is doing something weird. Like, what's he doing? Mario yells at the baby monitor because it's a two-way baby monitor, which reminds me. Wouldn't it be distracting for Mario and Rosalina while they're doing whatever they do, hearing whatever Jeffy's doing? In fact, that would be kind of weird. And wouldn't it also be kind of weird since Jeffy can hear through the baby monitor too, apparently, to hear Mario and Rosalina doing whatever they're doing? Just a little tangent. Jeffy notices Mario yelling, and thinks Mario is trapped in the Monster Destroyer, so Jeffy knocks it over. 
Mario scolds Jeffy, but Jeffy says it's too late because the monster already pooped in his pajamas. <sighs> so Mario and Rosalina resort to just sitting with Jeffy and having him sleep. <sighs> so much for adult time. We get a funny joke with Jeffy screaming, and the video ends. So, in the end, I thought this video was pretty funny. No, uh, no, 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 no. This was a Mario torture video. I hate Jeffy. I hope he burns in hell and dies. Did I tell you guys I hate Jeffy yet? Eh, I could see where some people are coming from with that. I mean, Mario did just want to have some alone time with Rosalina. That being said, I like this because the jokes were funny and it was all executed pretty well. I'll admit, by the end it was getting a bit stale, but I think it's a decent video. And about the Mario torture thing, remember that Jeffy doesn't know any better. Or, at least so we think. Unlike Chef PP torture, which has actually become pretty rare at this point. Good job, Logan. Let's take, I don't know, let's take Chef PP quits part 1, where Chef PP is being tortured by Bowser and Jr. due to sheer laziness, stupidity, or lack of care from Bowser and Jr. This video doesn't seem to be Mario torture, because Jeffy doesn't know better. Or so we think. But now for a rating. I'm gonna give this video a 4.5 out of 5 or color green range rating for being pretty funny, although getting stale near the end.